Hello everyone and welcome to another TDR Family Gaming video. This is Droid TDR, and today we are going to report back to Yoro Yo Oreo Yori Oreo I can't even. So, anyways, the big teddy bear guy. We found the three people that were playing hide and seek, the three little bears, silly bears, and now we're going to see if we can get something to help us with our quest to um, decontaminate shrines, something like that. Okay, let's talk to him. Hey, well done. Seem to be quite happy. Yes, they were totally goofballs. Let me ask them for you. Kyobi Koban was asking, if you are humans, why do you smell like tanuki? <laughs> what? I demand an explanation. Why do you smell like tanuki? Uh, you're only asking this now? Let's see, it was the masked shrine maiden? We ate some strange stuff. Right, that's what happened. Masked maiden cooked us a very lavish meal earlier. She said she used magic that she secretly learned from the baked Danuku to make. She learned our magic in secret? How dare she? Hmm, could it be? Oh, come on, that sneaky Kitsune. If she was still alive, she could at least have come over to say hello. She's a shrine maiden with a mask, and she calls you an old friend. I don't know anyone of the mask. Don't know any shrine maidens either. I'm sure do know Kitsune though. That said, that sneaky Kitsune did appear in the form of a shrine maiden before. What does the shrine maiden you speak of look like? She wears a white fox mask. Anything else? Short black hair, dressed as a shrine maiden. <laughs> and she wore a shrine maiden outfit. Hmm, do know her. Never seen anyone like that in my life. Is that so? Mm, yeah, sure, leave it to me. Shusi said, it was fun playing with you, thanks. I might have had fun too. So about that comb. I'm the world-renowned Bake Tanuki Yorio Oreo. And I would surely keep my word, you may have the comb. But what do you plan to do with the comb? It probably still smells like Kitsune. Well, here's what happened. You tell you are the cleansing ritual. Okay. What? I didn't realize that it was so important. You should have said so earlier. I sealed over this thing for... Uh... Stop speaking so lightly of my misfortunes. Never mind. It's all water under the bridge now. I do also have some inkling about the barrier near the forest. Back when I was fighting that sneaky Kitsune, I once saw it on the eastern seashore. Looked like a thunder Sakuru with a Tori gate. Hmm. Back when that guy was battling the demons or whatever, I was worried that some of them might come to hurt us. So I used magic to put a seal on that place. Let me see, the seal should be under the cliff face to the east. Kibuchi, take them there and remove the seal the seal. All right, all right, enough jibber-jabber. If you run into that sneaky kitsune, remember to send her my regards. Just say, let me think. You've tricked me off real good this time, you jerk. Oh, you ticked me off. Uh, come back and fight me. Our contest isn't over. And help me break the seal while you're at it, would you? It's not as if I couldn't do it myself or anything, but you still owe me a favor. Also, Gyobo Kuban says he misses you. Aw. Whoa, 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 that's a lot to remember. All right, so we have Yoro's ward, Oreo's ward. Head to the location of the barrier. Okay, which is where? Uh, that's not too far. Okay, we got that. East. Right by the seashore, he said, on a tree. By a tree. Okay, almost there. 
Oh, look. Things to mine. Which we'll mark on the map as things to mine. Right there. And things to mine. Wait, what? Ah, why does it always do that? You have to confirm. Yes, I really do want to put that there. Okay. Not mining it now, though. Instead, going somewhere near the ocean by a tree with a seal. Hmm. Seems like a chest, too, so we should probably grab that while we're at it. So it's probably this thing. This is it, just a bunch of bare stones. It seems to be using some kind of magic too. Whoa. That is pretty amazing. So this is the Baki Danuku magic. Seems kind of fun. Thank you. Let's play hide and seek next time. Hmm. <laughs> I like it. I like it. I like it. Destroy the barrier. All right. I don't know how to destroy the barrier, but I do know how to get chests. So let's go get the chest. Then we'll see if we can figure out how to destroy the barrier. All right. Now I'm a little bit concerned. We're going to come over here and a whole bunch of things are going to spawn in. Yeah. Look at you, Boomtail. Uh, out of the way. Oh. Yep. Let the show begin. Buddies. With sword comes shadow. B -b 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 -bies. Two of them should be down. That guy should be done. The joy of electric and water. Where is this guy? Oh, we might just be able to do this. Yes, from arrowheads. Count me happy. Oh, it's just a generic chest? Ugh. If it doesn't ruin a drink, it is a treasure. Alright, fine. Where's this carrot and why is it sitting on a rock? I don't know. We just like them. We like wet carrots on rocks. All right, now let's go do the seal. Okay, Diona, you might have to shield us if something hits us unexpectedly. We have to undo a barrier, eh? Time to dispel a barrier. Oh, is this another uh, little puzzle within <laughs> fight some Shogun Master? I think so, except we're all wet now. That's not good. We light everything up. Wait, we need a ward. Do we use the ward? Yes, of course. Oh. So it goes one, twos, three is far left, and then four. So this one needs to be one, and then the two in the back need to be twos. So this one is one. This one is four. The two in the back need to be twos. What do we get in the back? We have to climb up there, or we have to climb up there. Unless this is by height.
I don't know. I don't know. Let's see. Climb on up. We're gonna, go, we're gonna say it means the two in the back. So this one is two. Okay. Where's the other one? Should be another one around here somewhere. Maybe it's by height. Ah. No, climb up. Climb up. How do we get up further? Climb up that thing. You can walk on it here, can't you? Yeah. There must be something up higher. So I only see three of them. We have to go on the outside? Doesn't look like there's anything up here, though. Mm. That's strange. Oh. Ah, got it. That should be two. This should be three. Right? And then this one, whoops, the original one should be four. There we go. One, two, three, four. Unless it's by height. But if it's by position, starting at the first one, it connects twos. And then they connect to the third, which then connects to the fourth, I think. Let's try that. Hey, it seems to Come work. Come on, let's go bask in the sun of it. Get out of here! Shake it and stir it! Speed of light! Nowhere to hide! I'm ready! Cannot see him at all. Did that not hit you? There we go. Get out of there. Thank you. 
this! Teamwork is dream work! Huh? Out of the way! This is an over! Incoming! Get off the wall. Come on. Ka-ching, you know better than that. Feet of light. Yeah. Nowhere to hide. There we go. Okay, I don't know if I can beat those if I was in World 5, but that was pretty good. Whether he was dealing with your solutionary tricks or the way you defeat those demons. Yes. Uh-oh. It's a masked lady. Oh, uh, yeah, it's getting really old, lady. There's no need to do better at trivial things like this. That's so true. How's he doing? He's very spry. He was turned into stone. You recount what happened in the Chinju forest. Yes. Stone roly bear. Usually... When they make a mess, we don't send anyone to deal with them as long as they don't cross the line, after all. Although they are mischievous, they're kind-hearted and simple, like children. But when Iori dared to steal the ward, well, that was enough to get him punished. Since the Yugo three were mentioned in your story, then it was probably Kamuna, an Omeoyo from the passage who did the deed. Also mentioned a skitsy Sneaky Kitsune. Miss Mass Maiden, are you Kitsune, the Kitsune friend? That's quite the compliment. He was actually talking about the daughter of the Hakushin bloodline, also known as Kitsune Saigu. She was worshipped as the Kitsune goddess in many places long ago. Sky Kitsune, the Earth Kitsune, were once her emissaries. After she left, they all turned into stone statues to preserve their power and await her return. And when she does, they will walk the Baiko plane together once more. Okay. Following her departure, the bloodline and mythical might of the Kitsune today have dwindled to less than one-tenth of what it used to be. Wow. Oh, that. This is what happened. Did you know his full name? The Hidden Protector of the Grove? No, I didn't know that. It may be dull and impish, but he is a kind and loyal. That's why the Kitsune Saigo aimed to guide him to the right path a long time ago. In order to make sure that he would comply with the Electra Archon's rule, the Kitsune Saigo set the two of them up and got Oreo appointed as the protector of the grove. This made him responsible for the safety of the Chinju forest. Okay. That's when the world became pitch black. The Kitsune Saigo was worried that Oreo might die while fighting against the inexorable evil in his capacity as protector of the forest. So she used a game of hide-and-seek, something the Benaki Danuki are good at. Hmm. Fully kitchen, I see. She'll not lose this game. Is that so? Well, go on, then go hide. You'll never find me here. I don't believe you. Now make sure you go find... Okay. Whatever happens, they're all my magic tricks. Don't fall for them and don't show up, she said. Of course, you sneaky Kitsune, I will definitely defeat you this time, said Oreo. And that's how their endless contest began. So, Oreo is still waiting for her to come back and find him. Based on what you said about him, that appears to be the case. But after a while, he seems to have sensed that something was wrong and started wreaking havoc. He even stole the ward in an attempt to lure them out. He didn't realize there was something was required. In the cleansing ritual, he just thought it was a comb of some importance. Later, he sealed him in stone due to that misstep. She was swallowed up by darkness. Holy smokes. In the end, after the darkness was defeated, she returned to the great land along with the soil. Me? As you can see, I am just... Hana Chirito. Chirizito. Hana Chirizo. Whatever. Shrine Maiden wants to borrow your strength to destroy these evils. This mass maiden is really strange that you know so many things about the past that most people don't. You even know how to use Bakke Tanuki magic and cook Tanuki dishes. 
you don't know much about the present. It's almost like you're someone from a few centuries ago. Uh, you also saw someone who looked like you in some memories. She even had the name, same name as you, so... You must be just like Oreo, who was sealed several centuries ago. No, 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 no. That's not who I... I inherited her memories. As for other things, please forgive me. I cannot speak of them yet. I made you a promise back in the cave. So, when the time comes, I will reveal everything. What do we do? Let's leave it at that. Okay, if you say so, Paimon will have some faith in Miss Mass Maiden too. Thank you. Now, we must part here for the time being. Goodbye. We part in body alone, for our hearts drift with the clouds. I will pray for your success beneath the well in Kanda village. I shall be next to the thunder Sakuru root that you cleansed successfully. When the tree roots at all five places have been cleansed, look for me there. All right, so we've done what, three now? Yes. Oh, sweet. Primo gems. How many more do we need? How many more do we need? We need... 40 more. Oi. Okay, then. Quests. What are the quests for primos? Ho, 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 ho. We've done one of three. We need two more. And we get 60. That sounds like a good way to get it. And here we have 40. Okay, let's hope we don't have to do that for another round of 10 wishes. But you never know. What's with these story quests? Oh, I've unlocked things, have I? I have. Do I want to use my keys? No, I don't. Not yet. Thank you, though. Ooh, I've got all sorts of things I can unlock now. Wow, 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 wow. Goodness. Well, it looks like we're going to go and find another one of these. Let's go see where that is on the map. Are you looking at the wrong map again? It keeps looking at Liyue. Silly, Liyue Harbor. That is not where we're at. This is the map we need. All right, where's the next spot? You're kidding? Does it not show? Does not show. Why does it not show? I don't know where to go. Hmm, maybe they're all in the forest. I'm all for work-life balance, but I think this is pushing it. All right, let's go read the quest one more time. Maybe it gives us, whoops, not that. Drumming festival, tomorrow I can get 60 primos there. Let's see. Cleansing defilement. In order to do the cleansing ritual. Beside Kanda village and the abandoned shrine, there are three other places. Where the barrier surrounds the roots. Chenju Forest, which I think we just did. Aruami. And below the tidal flats. I think that's where we are. Aren't we? Below the tidal flats. Outside Kimisato's estate. Well, let's, let's look at the Aruami. And then we'll figure out. Because I, th I think we did the forest one. Ah, let's go back in the forest. But we will do that in the next one, because right now, it's time to say goodbye. Thanks for watching. See you in the next one. Bye-bye.